It's hard to have siblings when you grow up and your family gets big. Why is it on the holidays we always have to go to the person house who, who uh, does the best? In our, why can't we go to the one who does the worst? <laughs> why can't we go to Tadutu's house? <laughs> okay, His girlfriend has lawn chairs with duct tape. Wouldn't matter if we messed those up. <laughs> I got a cousin who's a hoarder. We could all go to her house. She would never know. tornado hit her house, it would just put stuff away. I mean, it's... <laughs> Choppers would be flying over. There's horrible and utter devastation, except for this one house. It's <laughs> Family was different. Just being a kid, you could do what you wanted. You know, it, it was a different time. And you know, you, you, you tried, to, tried to stay in a group. That was the other big thing. Because God forbid you got lost. No one looked for you. <laughs> No one looked for you. There was no Amber alert for us. I didn't even know a broad name Amber. Until I was 21 and went to Vegas. I picked up one of those hooker trading cards off the ground. I'm like, no wonder they're letting everybody know she's coming to town. Uh, got it. They didn't look for you when we were kids, did they? What'd they do? Huh? Didn't do anything. They did psychics and search dogs walking the grid. They just took your school picture and put it on a milk carton. <laughs> and you better pray people had cereal for breakfast. Because <laughs> if they had bacon and eggs, you'd be lost forever. <laughs> it was a tough generation. Even, even the commercials were t Like, do you remember? You can go watch this on YouTube somewhere. There was a commercial that these kids tried to feed their little brother all the food that they didn't want to eat. <laughs> Remember? Feed it to Mikey. He likes it. <laughs> and they would force feed this kid all their food. And apparently, in the one commercial, he liked it, so they were happy. But what that means is they had fed him other stuff that he had thrown up <laughs> a whole bunch of times. And those kids became famous. Right, they, they even was a rumor, there was a rumor about Mikey from the commercial, that we had a rumor that he had Pepsi and Pop Rocks, <laughs> and it killed him. <laughs> That's how jacked up our generation was, <laughs> that nobody spoke to us, that we thought Pepsi and Pop Rocks would kill you. <laughs> we had the weirdest thing. There were, just say no, Right, that was a wonderful thing. Nancy Ray, had, then they had a commercial, uh, This Is Your Brain, and it was a, a frying pan, right? And they would crack an egg on it. This is your brain, and this is the frying pan, right? Okay, look, this is, and then they would crack the egg, and it would fry, and they go, this is your brain on drugs. Like, it's all fried up. And, and then you're like, oh, that looks good. And uh, <laughs> wait a second. God forbid that commercial came on and my father was sitting in the living room with us. Don't worry about the egg, I'm just gonna hit you with the pan if you do drugs. 